Hi, this is Laura Lee Chin. I'm here with MyCookshelf.com reporting at the Shade Hotel in Manhattan Beach for MyCookshelf.com. And I'm here with Philippe Bascol for Inglenook Winery. How are you today, Philippe? Yeah, fine, thank you. And I understand that uh, you have quite a story. You came to us from a little place in Bordeaux, from what I understand. So could you tell us a little bit more about that and then talk about the wines today? So I came from Chateau Margaux, where I spent uh, 20 years. And so I decided to move in 2011 to come to Inglenook and uh, to be part of this great adventure and to make this great wine. Okay, let me just film them here just a second, if you don't mind. So let me just go down here through. We've got the the white and the white, the reds. And you're going to tell us a little bit about each one of them. So, so uh, Blancano is, uh, is a white blend we made with Roussan, Marsan and Grenier, which is very unusual, but it's a wonderful blend. Uh, Roussan and Marsan uh, uh, bring the uh, minerality and uh, low alcohol level and uh, low acidity, uh, but uh, very good uh, body in, in the palette. And the Viognier brings the aromas, uh, high acidity, high level of sugar. So the blend uh, works very well and it's uh, very fresh and uh, uh, very long assistance white wine. Okay, and the second one? Then we we have 1882, which is uh, the first vintage of this wine. Uh, it's a 100% Cabernet Sauvignon. It's our uh, entry level of Cabernet Sauvignon, and uh, it's in a, in a great vintage 12. So it's a, it's a very good wine to enjoy immediately. Okay. Then we have Cask Cabernet Sauvignon in a vintage 2011. Uh, which, uh, of course, you know, it's a challenging vintage. But uh, we have a very good uh, freshness in this wine. It's a mix of uh, a blend of Cabernet Sauvignon, Cabernet Franc, and Merlot. And uh, we can enjoy this wine also now, uh, because the tannins are very, very soft. Okay. And we finish with the Rubicon, okay. which is uh, our first selection. So, uh, in uh, 2009, which is the first vintage, of Rubicon with a new brand in the nook okay. that uh, is our original name and uh, it's a blend of Cabernet Sauvignon 97% and uh, a small percentage of uh, Cabernet Franc okay. and uh, of course this one is very concentrated uh, very perfumed very very persistent and so of course you can enjoy that but I would recommend to, uh, to store for a few years more. How long? Drink. How long? It depends on your taste, but I would say uh, two, three years at least. Okay. But if you minimum, have, uh, yes. If you have a grandchildren, I think you can uh, <laughs> keep the wine for them. Oh, that sounds great. Philippe, thank you so much for your time today. You're this welcome. is uh, Laura Lee Chin. I'm here at the Inglenook booth at the Stars of Napa, Napa Valley here at the Shade Hotel for Wine LA. And this is mycookshelf.com. Laura Lee Chin reporting. Thank you. Thank you.